Tires are one of the most important component of a vehicle, be it a car or a motorcycle, but we there often tend to overlook them and only give them importance once they are worn out or in need for replacement. Since tires are the main and only contact point between the vehicle and the road, the condition directly affects the safety. Michelin has recently launched a new set of tire called the Energy XM2 Plus and the company claims that this tire offers better performance than its competition not only in dry conditions but as well as in wetter conditions. The brand promises that in comparison to the competition, the Energy XM2 Plus is able to stop 2.4 meters shorter on wet road conditions when brand new and 3.3 meters shorter than the competition when worn out. We are at the Vapco Proving Grounds in Chennai to test the same. So right now in the test vehicle which has a brand new set of Energy XM2 Plus. We will be taking this car on a particular section of the course which has been designed to simulate real road driving conditions. With me is Arun from Idiada and he will be guiding me on how and what I am going to encounter here. So welcome Arun. Yes. Uh, let's right. begin. Let's hit the roads. I want to pass through those cones. Here is the car. Keep going, keep going. This test track has a well paved road. However, sections of it were designed in such a way that we were able to experience the Energy XM2 Plus performance at different speeds and were quite impressed. The tyre was able to offer superior levels of grip. However, we would be able to shed more light on the performance of the same once we get to test this tyre in real road surfaces and conditions. After this, we moved on to check the wet road performance of the Michelin Energy XM2 Plus in comparison to its segment rival that is the Bridgestone B290. For this, similarly specced cars were selected and strapped down with a worn out set of Energy XM2 Plus and B290 respectively. We were to drive the test cars to a speed of 100 km per hour, enter the wet track and smash on the brakes. The Michelin says that even in worn out condition, the Energy XM2 Plus performs better than the competition and stops 3.3 meters before it. Though we do not have the exact measurements of the difference between the stopping distances of the two tyres, as you can see, the Energy XM2 Plus was able to bring the car to a complete halt well before the B290. Not only this, the XM2 Plus felt more stable under heavy braking. Now behind me, as you can see, the white cone represents the stopping distance of the Michelin Energy XM2 Plus in wet road conditions, whereas the red cone represents the competition <laughs> which is the Bridgestone B290 used as a benchmark. Now there is clearly a difference of more than a car and a half length between the two. It clearly shows that the Energy XM2 Plus is able to offer better braking performance in wet road condition even when it's worn out. That said, the Energy XM2 Plus does command a slight premium over the competition. However, as it offers more safety, it's something we would recommend you to use. I hope you like this video and if you want more such videos, stay tuned to Express Drives and do not forget to subscribe. Until next time, see you.